Hey, this is Dave. I want to do a little bit of myth busting, a little prepper myth busting. This is potassium permanganate. You see in a lot of uh, little websites, little videos, that it's something that every prepper should keep in their first aid kit for fire starting and all sorts of other stuff. Here is some uh, permanganate on the table, really fine powder. Okay. Really fine powder. And they say that if you mix that with just a little bit of glycerin, it'll start a fire. So, bam. I'm all about starting fire, so I got some glycerin. Just one little drop. Oh, wait for it. Wait for it. Hmm. Nothing's happening. You know why? Because it's cold outside. Oh, here we go. It did do it there in a minute. But did you see how long that took? You know why it took it that long? Because it's cold. And potassium permanganate and glycerin need an ambient temperature of about 70 degrees to work good okay now let's think about when you're going to need fire in a wilderness survival scenario maybe when it's cold i don't know so maybe that's not the best thing but potassium permanganate is some pretty cool stuff it is a very strong oxidizer um, it reacts with a lot of things and when it does burn, it burns about 240 degrees Celsius, which is pretty freaking hot. Um, because it's a big, powerful oxidizer, when you mix it with any acid, uh, a lot of organic uh, materials, it will ignite. Um, you can mix it with sugar, put a drop of water to light on fire. You can use the stuff uh, to... to uh, uh, disinfect water that isn't necessarily purifying water that's killing things in the water it won't do anything for uh, chemicals or uh, other contaminants um, you use it for a lot of stuff and I'm not saying it's not useful but uh, you know I've been wanting to do this video for a while and I ended up having to just eBay sub because they don't really carry it around in a lot of stores sometimes you hear people say you can buy it as pot perm uh, for cleaning out uh, water filters and stuff but Lowe's and Home Depot and stuff, I, I haven't seen it in any of the stores. So, but you can get glycerin at the, you know, Walmart or the pharmacy. When I went over there and asked for some, they're like, what are you doing with it? And I was like, I make soap, right? Um, so, there you go. Prote potassium permanganate is pretty neat, and you can mix it and make fire. But uh, carrying two chemicals around with you in your first aid kit that really don't have a lot of other you know reasonable uses I think you could probably have space for say matches right why carry something that only works 70 degrees above Would you carry flint and steel or a ferricium rod or a matches or you know all the other smaller lighter easier more likely to work when you need it solutions here we go. Thank you. If a little good's more is better. Do a little dance. Make a little love. Make fire tonight. Oh, make fire tonight. I've seen some knuckleheads. Ooh, fire, fire. I've seen some knuckleheads actually, uh, see how it melted? Mix some magnesium powder, some really fine mesh magnesium powder in with this. The problem is that makes like a flash powder and it explodes, which is pretty freaking stupid because you've got something that will explode and then you're mixing a liquid in it and then basically you're running and you don't really know when it'll go off. Uh, those guys get the Darwin Award besides uh, probably do something that's illegal. So anyway, I just thought that was cool.